our teeth into Mexican jalapeno burgers, slather ourselves with the sexiest dessert, peanut butter menage a trois. We also hop My on building building right here. And even though many of the old meat packers have packed up and moved on to other areas, there is a new player in town. And it is where you can find the beef for under 10 bucks. Right at the corner of 9th and 13th in the space formerly occupied by the Hog Pit is the home of Bill's Bar and Burgers. They get their meat from Butcher Pat Lafrida, so you know it's always fresh, but it's also affordable. Today, Chef Brett's taking us behind the line to make me this, the spicy jalapeno, because I like a burger that bites back. But he says the secret to burger success is a serious press on your patty. So we're going to press this burger into the griddle a little bit. What that's going to do is that's going to allow it to adhere to the griddle. And we're going to get this really caramelized, crunchy crust, if you will, on the outside of my burger. We're going to put a slice of Jack cheese on. We're going to just cover this bad boy for a second. We're going to put a little spicy sauce on here. We're going to put a little lettuce underneath. So now we have our burger. We're going to top that with pico de gallo. Can't have a spicy jalapeno burger without some jalapenos. And there you have the Mexican or the spicy jalapeno. Yeah, you better get a good shot of that before I wreck it. You want to get that drip because that's juicy goodness. Juicy, juicy, yummy burger goodness. And three, two, one. Get that crunch from the beef. Jalapeno! Oh, oh, look at that. I'll get a big a little pink inside, mm. crunchy goodness on the outside. All right, Brett, woo! I'm done. This burger rocks. What's this bad boy gonna cost me? $8.50. Build Barn Burger. Can't beat it. Can't beat it! Oh man, that is good. Mmm. Now if you scarf down that spicy jalapeno burger, you can chop it off with a classic shake right here at Bill's. This is the peach melba. Mmm. And it is delicious. But if you are looking for something a little more cutting edge, you're going to want to head across the street to catch.